What's up everybody, this is Carolina Mike, your host for SharePoint in 60 Seconds, where you get the information you need right up front, and if you want more, stick around for a step-by-step walkthrough. Today we're going to show you just how stinking easy it is to integrate SharePoint into Microsoft Teams. You could show a page in a channel, stick around! I'm a SharePoint expert, play with data extra, careful with my hands cause I gotta use them forward. Yeah, I'm a big old nerd, I like maple syrup. All my pancakes, I don't care what you heard. Okay, let's get that stinking timer rolling. But before we do, please like, share, subscribe. We appreciate you. Okay, get the timer going. All right, so you got this channel here. You got a channel about how to how to take notes in Teams, but you got a page in SharePoint. You want to show that page inside this channel. So all you got to do is go click on SharePoint. Oh my goodness, we're getting close. And the timer's still rocking and rolling. And then we're going to go to the team and we're going to look for the pages. And we're going to say there's a page. There's a page right there. How to take notes in a team. Save! You did it! Amazing. Okay, now we're going to, we're going to breathe. Whew. We're going to slow it down a little bit and we're going to take it step by step and talk about what is this madness, this amazingness that we have just created? I know amazingness isn't a word, but I just made it a word. You can't stop me. It's going to be in Webster's. Go look it up. Okay, so here's the deal. All right, Teams, SharePoint, Egg, Chicken. Well, actually, in this case, SharePoint came before Teams. Okay, nevertheless, uh, you cannot have a team without having a SharePoint site underneath. It just doesn't happen can't work just an impossibility you don't believe me just try okay with that if you want to like totally keep people in teams and you don't want them really bouncing into like sharepoint proper what do i mean by sharepoint proper well right now we're in a teams window we're in the teams application but remember i said there's a sharepoint site underneath always will be it looks like this Oh snap, it looks just like almost where we just came from, but we are now in SharePoint proper. I know that's not really technically a thing, but we're in SharePoint in a web browser, okay? SharePoint in a browser, SharePoint via a Microsoft Teams channel tab. So I said that to say this, if you find yourself in a situation where you are developing out content or pages inside the SharePoint space, Let's say you've got a channel about how to take notes in Teams and you've got other resources like a list and document library or or other stuffs. Um, you may have a page where you want people to go to and see all that stuff in one spot. Well, if you don't want people to have to open up a separate browser window, you can... Now, let's backtrack a little bit. This page just so happens to be living inside the same SharePoint site as the team is connected to so that was example a there is another example that we can run through where if you wanted to show any site that is not connected to that Microsoft team then you can add a tab go to SharePoint and then let's say we want to grab something from this site which is not connected to that team this is a totally separate site I can copy that URL and then go over here into Teams, say any SharePoint site, paste that bad boy in, save it, you say we could not complete for real. Is that is that is that how we're gonna do it? Is is that really? Is that how we're gonna do this? For real. You're you're seriously gonna do that to me. Oh my gosh. You know what? I'm not even gonna stress about it. I know the URL was good. Teams can't complete the action. I imagine in a few days uh, it will be able to complete that action. Uh, I did do a quick little search in the community and a few days ago someone reported the same thing. So there, I blame teams. Uh, with that, uh, I hope this gives you some insight on how to integrate SharePoint with your Microsoft Teams channels. Again, to recap, let me get out of this crazy loop. You're going to go up to, you're going to go into the channel where you want to show this SharePoint page uh, and you're going to click on add a tab. You'll visit the SharePoint option and then 
For now, you're going to need to look at pages that are on your actual site that's connected to this team. Uh, in the past, I've been able to just choose a page from any site. I mean, I was able to do this like just a few days ago. You just paste in the link and then you're you're totally good to go. So with that, please like, share, subscribe. Also, let me know what you would like to see about integrating things from SharePoint into a Microsoft team. Remember, do the very best you can with what you got. SharePoint rocks, and so do you. We'll see you next time, y'all. I'm a SharePoint expert, play with data extra. Careful with my hands, cause I gotta use them forward. Yeah, I'm a big old nerd. I like maple syrup on my pancakes. I don't care what you heard.